I believe there's an undeniable connection between neighborhood, family, and child well-being. We all do better and feel better if we experience a sense of well-being and a sense of belonging. Children succeed in loving families. Families succeed in supportive communities and communities have the answers. It is critical for parents to give their child attention, but that is so challenging when there is so much noise pulling for their attention in different directions. So the most important person in a child's ecosystem will always be the parent. But when we put all the onus and responsibility on one individual, and more importantly, we release the responsibility of society who often are the ones that cause these conditions to which the child's ecosystem might be limited. The historic harm that West Oakland has experienced is deeply rooted in multi-generational trauma. You're talking about an area where culture and identity has been turned upside its head. When you are in a neighborhood where sometimes resources are slim to none, your parenting skills are doubled sometime with making sure that you provide for your own kids and making sure that they're safe within this neighborhood that you want to see be better. Before joining Lincoln, I did feel that there was not enough resources in getting food or free supplies and definitely a lack of activities for my child. First Five has greatly enhanced our ability to support our community. With the support of First Five Alameda County and the Neighborhoods Ready for School initiative came a wealth of resources, of brain power, of people power, of connections and community that allowed our Mandela Family Resource Center to truly thrive. Mandela Family Resource Center is a place-based family resource center that is open to all the community to come in and gather the resources that they need to support and strengthen their family. Lincoln has programs that assist families with delinquent rent. I was able to receive childcare, play groups once a week, parent classes once a month. The Mandela FRC definitely opened up a lot of activities for my child. My favorite one was they would pass out monthly developmental toys for the children. So it wasn't just a toy, it actually was something that would get them in the practice of, you know, meeting their developmental landmarks. Place-based initiatives are critical in how they benefit community. Oftentimes we have asked traditionally for families to come to us. In the medical model, if someone was sick, if their young person had asthma, they would have to go to a medical office and walk in there. Place-based model says, we are going to you. And that is critical. 